I see. Hi, welcome to Five Verse with the Kwame Amo. In this edition, we're going to give you the five reasons why I think Dr. Mahama Dubaumia may win the NPP presidential primaries and go on to win the 2024 presidential elections. First of all, Dr. Mahama Dubaumia is the most popular, most visible, most engaging, most dynamic vice president of the Fourth Republic, AGRB. Until 2012, John Dramani Mama was in that setting. So coming into the picture after 2016, becoming the Vice President of Ghana in 2017, Dr. Muhammad Baumia has been very visible. He's been very instrumental in this government's achievements. He's led in so many of the policies introduced by this government. Others have called him Dr. Digital. Uh, others have named him Waliwali Wali Adam Smith. So he's been everywhere and for my bet, a very popular vice president like that has the likelihood to become the president of Ghana in 2024. I also think Dr. Baumia is very popular amongst the NDC. Anytime the NDC is talking about a particular person within the NPP and the 2024 election, it is Dr. Mahamadou Baumia. He's been a thorn in the flesh of the National Democratic Congress and guess what? Is the man they target. Do you hear the NDC talk about Alan Tremanti, who was part of the government until his resignation? Do you hear them talk about the Free Akutu, for instance, the Greek minister? No. The target is on Dr. Baumia, and his popularity within the opposition party tells you that if anybody win the ticket for the NPP, it is the vice president. It may not resonate with many, but I think it will play a part in Dr. Baumia winning the 2024 elections. Religion. The man's religion will play a significant part in his annexing of the presidency in 2024 if he scales through from the presidential primaries of the new patriotic party. It will be the first time a Muslim is at the forefront of Ghana politics. It will be the first time a Muslim is heading a major political party into an elections. And I'm sure Muslims, you know, within Every political sphere could be from the NDC, from the CPP, from other political parties rallying support behind him. And I guess if the new patriotic party elect him as their presidential candidate, he is likely to win the presidency based strictly on his religious background, a Muslim. Another factor that may play out well for Dr. Baumia is his age. The man is less than 60 and relatively he's one of the youngest politicians Ghana will be having to lead a major political party into elections. And the Fourth Republic, it seems we change presidency in terms of age. It was John Ajekum Kufo, and then a relatively younger person came, John Atamils. And then a younger person came, John Dramani Mahama. Now we switched from a younger person to an old person, Anna Adodankwa Akufuadu. Now, it's likely that Ghanaians may go back to a relatively young person, and that young man is Dr. Mahamud Baumia. And if he is able to beat the earth in the new patriotic party presidential primaries in November, then he's likely to rally the youth behind him to become the next president of Ghana. The final point is that at this juncture of Ghana's development, we need an economist. Because of the tatters, COVID-19 has put the economy Ghana needs an economist par excellence to manage the affairs of the country. And at this point of um, political activity for next year's elections, uh, the man who stands tall in terms of the economy to manage affairs for Ghana, irrespective of the fact that he's part of the current government, it is Dr. Mahama Dubaumia. He's an economist par excellence. He knows what the current economy is, digitalization, and to digitalize the economy is what Ghana needs at this moment. He's done a lot when it comes to economy. He was an assistant professor at Baylor University at some point in time. He was the head of the African Development Bank in Zimbabwe at some point in time. It means when it comes to the 2024 elections, Ghanaians will show love to this man who knows the ins and outs of the economy. So these are my five reasons why I think Dr. Baumia may become president of Ghana in 2024. And that is if he's able to scale the presidential primaries of the new patriotic party. It's in two folds. One is in August and one is in November. If he's, he manages to come out 
of those two crucial elections and he becomes the flag bearer of the new patriotic party then these are my reasons why i think he's likely to become president of ghana this has been five this week with Kwame amo follow us on all our social media pages and go to 3news.com for more stories i'm out